Hey everyone, it's Francis Xavier, logging on to make awesome videos one at a time, and here we are with my trusty co-host Darren. Hey everybody, we've been waiting for this for a year. So, Three boxes of Yu-Gi-Oh! Ghosts from the Past. As you can see, you. the cover card is you get a chance at a Ghost Rare Blue Eyes alternative. First time it's ever gotten a Ghost Rare. Uh, but that's not the chase card we're doing, because you know it's my job on his show to tell you the card we're actually chasing for. We've been waiting over a year for Red Supernova Dragon to come to English, and you have a shot at it in the set. Along with a lot of other goodies, but I honestly cannot remember most of the list, so this is actually going to be a surprise for me. I found six cases of these to target and decided to not be a filthy scalper and only get three, and now I'm honestly wishing I did get six because now online they're ridiculously expensive. Twice the MSRP. Nice guys finish last, Avery. You gotta get what you can, only because mm. others are gonna take it from you. Especially, yeah. I'm surprised you found any in stores, because you said it's hard to find anything not magic in stores. Yeah, Pokemon and Yu-Gi-Oh, they're both getting ridiculously Scalpers scalped. are ruining everything. Ooh, oh, this is oh, a neat little case. Oh, is there still more tape? Just one little thing right here. Alrighty. Oh, how many packs are in this? Look. A Dark Magician and the... And the Eroded Firewall Dragon. Which, yeah. honestly, it should have just been printed like that if... Wow, that's a lot of wasted packaging for, like, three packs. Of five cards per. Wow, okay. I mean, that's why they're all, like, ultra rares and stuff. Yeah. Thanks, Konami. Oh, bunny. Mm -hmm. Evil Thorn, Residator Cool, Ooh, in Ultra, Salaman Great Fowl, Terror of Trishula, and Evenly Matched. Nice. I know someone who's getting that Resonator Call Ultra Rare. It's actually, I'm not actually getting the Supernova this time. Usually uh, we're hunting for a card for me or him. We're actually hunting for a friend of ours. He plays Red Dragon more than I do. Time Thief Chrono Corridor, Sunseed Genius Loki. Loki. Okay. Right. Sunvine Gardna, Lava Lal Dragon, Starry Knight, Starry Dragon. Remember the old normal monster Seiryu? Yeah, yeah that's its archetype now. Oh, of course, everything is getting an archetype now. Hey, that's good though. Uh, remember when Yu-Gi-Oh cards just used to have just did their own things and work with other cards? Pepperidge Farm remembers. I mean, some of the archetypes work with other cards too. Hieratic Seal from the Ashes. Sayuri. you speak of the devil. Rare Metal Foes, Bisma Gear. Artifact, Durandal, and Arm Dragon level 10. I guess the next pack's mine. Yeah. And mine to open and struggle with. This tool is actually kind of smooth as butter for me. I don't know why my buddy has such trouble with it when he works at Amazon. Uh, oh, sorry. Eh. Oh. I'm personally praying for that. Ouch, my toe. Ghost for, ghost for a dark magician. You're going to put that in immediately. Oh, totally. Next time I'm just getting a box. Like yeah. A Sunseed Twin. Sun Avalon Bloom. Higher Attic Seal of Reflection. Resonator Engine. Time Thief Double Barrel. Wow, this is disappointing. Huh. Definitely should have gotten more of those packs. Definitely should have. Like... I, I, I appreciate you uh, being nice about it, but we really need this. So, I see the convocation. Madolce Petting Kasur, I think. Cosmojo. Metal Steelen. Hieratic Sky Dragon Overlord of Heliopolis. The retrained Sun Dragon Overlord. Not bad. <laughs> they really needed more main deck support, though, honestly. Totally. It's like that time where. Photons and Galaxies needed main deck support, and uh, they kept getting extra deck with a full extra deck. No. Malolche Pudding Cess, Time Thief Winder, Dragonity Phalanx, Mask Change, Starry Night Rail, and no, that was it. Huh? Yeah. Last box. Wow, this is really disappointing. These packs are puny. I didn't realize how puny these packs were. I should have paid better attention to the website. God, we're, 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 we're like the Yu-Gi-Oh! equivalents of Julia Ch child when it comes to unboxing because this is all just totally unscripted i mean to be fair most unboxings are unscripted but you think there's a little bit of preparation before this but no this is all like totally on the fly yeah you're just like hey i grabbed some from target i saw the release date and that's just how we kind of do our videos hey this thing's this thing we like is coming out cool let's get it and do a video about it that's just how we do it there, there's nothing else to it that's our secret <laughs> yeah all right last three packs Let's open the Firewall Dragon pack first. 
Hopefully we'll actually find something we care about. Mist Valley Baby Rock. The Monarchs Erupt. Son of Alondrius. Son of Exceeds Burst. Time Thief Adjuster. So far, it's nothing we care about. Uh, okay, the Resonator Call was nice, but... A bit disappointing. Just Not gonna lie. Party! Update Jammer. Heos on Ryu. Cosmo Dark Lady. Salvage... And Dragoony Legatus. Okay, here it is. Last pack, moment of truth. Come on, Dark Magician! Now, this video's gonna be a lot shorter than I thought it would. Yeah. I thought each one had, like, 12 packs or something in them. I thought each pack had, like, 9 cards. Hieratic Seal of Supremacy. Hieratic Dragon of Tefnuit. Hieratic Dragon Sun... Hieratic Sun Dragon Overlord of Heliopolis. S Sun Vine Healer and Sun Avalon Dryonome. Nope. Nothing. Wow. That's kind of bad. <laughs> Well, um... This was over a lot faster than I thought it would be. I just at least get ten minutes out of this. Yeah. Well, who knows? Maybe we'll find some more later next time. Hopefully, and if there are still any left. Yeah. Who knows? There's lots. There's always more time in the day. Alright, well... It's only just begun. For now, hopefully see you next time. This is Francis and Aaron logging off. Woo!